Yes. So that's us checked out. I don't really have a plan to be honest. And um, the train's like one o'clock, obviously train stations like we are in the city, which is like an hour's walk. I'm thinking get the tram like we did last night, um, down to the sort of main bit. And I wanna try that tower that I went to last night at about five o'clock because it was dark and there were people in it. So I'm thinking maybe that they were just closing up for the night, I don't know. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna do that. <clears throat> I'm gonna see if that is climbable. Sick if that is, man. Um, and obviously we're getting a train at one. Brussels gets it at Brussels about three, half three, something like that, about two hours of train. Sure, pretty a nice train as well, so yeah, looking forward to that. Look at that, man, that's where I stayed, that's insane. Very fancy inside and all that. SBR Range Rover, hello. Alright, um, so we'll get the tram. Find it first. So we're about to get the tram, we're waiting on the tram. That's the tram stop there. And this is what's sitting right here. Look at this, bro. That's insane. Absolutely insane. And then right behind it. Is that 911? That is 911. Just bonkers. Just sit in the street. walking here on Sunday compared to yesterday it was Saturday it's so quiet it's like 10 o'clock what time is it? it's 10 to 11 right? it's 10 to 11 yesterday it was absolutely packed today it's dead it's so quiet can I always properly smooth you can see reflections the water and stuff So you're just, I think this is the way we go to the tower. So I can remember. Find it in a minute, I guess. So I don't know if I can get up there. It is open, so the door's just there, right? But I went in and it, like the door's open, the automatic door, so the door's open. But there was like people singing, like dancing, but it was like, obviously like hymns and stuff. And I was like, when? Why? <laughs> oh, fuck that. So, I'd, so I'd go in and invite me to dance or that. Right? I don't know though, it looked cool. Yeah. Alright, so it's 11, it's 11 o'clock. Um, we're basically near the train station. The train station's like over there somewhere, I think. Um, so we'll see if we can hit any 
eight towers. And uh yeah. So peaceful. So quiet. Just one person. Okay, so we're on the train station. Past two two different people. What station it was? Cause like, like it's on the screen. It's obviously popping up the destinations, and I couldn't see across it anywhere. But I asked two different people, and they both said 15A. So we're going to 15A, I guess. And if we end up in somewhere mental, then. Yeah. That's what it's gonna be. We're saying Tallies or something. Like that. Yeah. Find out this What's going to roll me? What's going to rate me now? Train station. Very massive. I am going to get to the hotel. And I'll be back. So for the maps. Point six miles is 13 minutes. You know, you know what's the same, right? <laughs> Yesterday, at this time, Yesterday we're obviously in Amsterdam, right? Like yesterday morning, we're in Scotland. <laughs> like 
two hours ago we were in Amsterdam. How fried is that? But obviously it's different because obviously you can fly in like an hour from you know Scotland to Holland, but to get a train. It's so quiet, like the actual train itself. Mate, you get a train in like Scotland and you hear like every obviously one of the tracks and all that, you hear every single like bit of track. It's just silent. It is mad. Big comfy, has a leg room, seats are proper comfy. Even left up here. So cool, man. look at it. So, Amsterdam was very like touristy, very English, English, but a lot of people spoke the lingo, you know what I mean? Or spoke English rather. Whereas, I don't know about Brussels. Brussels is also a bit. I don't know if it's smaller or the same size, I have no idea. But, like I said, according to Google, there are a lot of sort of bell towers and church towers and stuff. And that you can climb. So we're gonna have a dog. Doggy balcony, that's amazing. Um, so we're gonna try to find a balcony we can climb, or a balcony tower. I think we can. Got like two hours left till um, sunset, so should be good. They're giving me Paris vibes to be honest. What are the kind of streets and houses now? That big ass thing. Perch. So we're. Is that Jack? It looks like. I don't know where that's going. Could be Jack. Clean like the pavements in that one. Look at that man, most people admire the buildings, I admire the pavements. It seems like a, a very chill kind of city. I mean, I've stand to this, I've stand was as well. But. I guess this is probably the outskirts or something. Okay, so we have made it to the Brussels Hotel. It's about 20 minute walk from the train station. Absolutely decent, don't mind if I do. Oh, look at this shower, that was insane. Well, that was the same shampoo, we had another one. Um, what's this? Covered, decent. It's a used stuff. Bed's pretty decent. Chair, blah blah blah. But bro, look at this view! You see that shit? Hold on. I will extend you guys a bit. Pretty decent view, man. I don't think I got, I don't think I requested this view, I just got the cheapest one, you know what I mean? I don't know what that is, is that the parliament building or something? That wouldn't make sense, right? Look at their little seating thing over there, that's insane. <sighs> Nuts, man. Sweet. Alright, well, I'm gonna uh, have a quick shower, and then we're gonna head out and try and hit a couple roofs. Let's get it! Okay, so the time is 16.02. See how much daylight we've got left? I think it's like an hour and a half. Sunset. Oh shit, an hour. Sunset and an hour. Okay. That changes things. So we have a check on and let's go hit some motherfucking rooftops. 
so we're on route to like the sort of royal square thing. Um, came up the street and found this lovely looking Maserati. So I'd take a stroll down this street. I did go to that big palace thing, um, and there was a walk through, it was pretty cool. I recommend that. Where is there? Oh, that is insane. Surely I can claim that. Claim that. There's a cathedral, so we're gonna go there. See when they're there. See that man go absolutely ham. Check my story on Instagram. We're on there. 
and everything's getting Paris a little bit. I thought they'd be Paris, but you know, Petra Paris, that's that's why I can you know, Petra. I think I found the cathedral. This looks like a cathedral to me. So we got my food, my beer, a little bit. There's no... Someone's got their drawer up. Yo, that's insane. I love it. Respect it. <laughs> I wasn't a big mine, but I just... Because there's obviously a lot of airports nearby, so I was like, nah, fuck that. Look at the drill. I love it. Respect it. Um, uh, this beer, by the way. This beer. It would it one and a half pints per big beer. Fourteen euro pint, right? So it's deep, but you know, compared to pint, it's like two pints essentially. If you're two, I drink that, I'd be two pints. Mad. I'm steaming it, but it's good. Pint's good. 
I still was with respect for them in, in Amsterdam. But there wasn't really any, I mean, obviously the big squares, but there was no like places to sit and eat or, you know. Um, oh, this is, this is just not. Got their drone for I love it. I love it. <laughs> yeah, man. Um, I'm gonna eat this food, drink this drink, probably get another one of this. Beer's really nice. I just said to him, get me like a beer. I don't care what beer it is. I can give him a little beer. Really good. And um, here we are. I highly recommend this little road square. Um, yeah, man. It's nuts. That's it. So we uh, finished the beer. Oh, it's a good one. Never mind. It's getting a little bit chilly now. Yes. Hey, you need to go on the It's everywhere though, like. Meters later, got this big Notre Dame looking thing. Like, look at that. Yeah, another like oh, 200 meters up there is a big Palace Justice thing. There's just stuff everywhere. Mind blowing. Absolutely mind blowing. Almost as if people in Belgium speak French. I guess France is nearby, right? But it's like they say merci and all that. I'm pretty sure merci is French, right? Could be completely wrong. Who knows? I do French other than Spanish. I can't even remember if I can Spanish. <laughs> <laughs> Our hotel isn't as out of town here than it was in Amsterdam. It's only it was only like a twenty minute walk from the cathedral to the hotel. But I went to eat here because I wanted to see this big sort of palace thing. And I'll get run over. We're going. Good nice. I've not been run over. Like this is so like massive. It really is. That's the fairest view from earlier on. So this is like the highest point they say. Point that dude. 
Um, I will not pick it up on that. Start saying, oh, what are you doing? Yes, you are. Right. Oh, no. no, 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 no. Good roller coasters, I've got mountains, I've got spirals. Good rock. Very smooth. Ah, sorry. Hell no. But this is the highest point in the city. So we're going to go for the Gandit. I mean, if you have your first screws, then it's heaven. Okay, so it's quarter to nine in the hotel. Pretty, pretty chillaxed, it's pretty chilled. Got my laptop. I've just imported the files from my laptop to, or from the GoPro to my USB drive. Um, so if I need to clear the footage from my, from my GoPro for tomorrow, I, said, I, I doubt it'll do because tomorrow's from like 6 a.m. I leave. I leave here at like 7 a.m. It might be late by then, it probably will to be honest, yeah, so I'll we'll probably film going from here to the airport and then, you know, on the airport and stuff, but that'll be quite cool, um, but yeah, it's 9pm, 9, 9 um, I went for my second beer and the guy actually gave me a map, he gave me a map and says, so we're here, right, so this is where the Hilton Garden is, that's where we are, that's that big sort of Justice Palace thing with the Ferris wheel, if we go up here, and then that's that big massive, I mean like massive ass garden. So if you walk through the garden, save, save this by the way, remember, if you're in Brussels, save this. Go through the big ass garden, and then that was, I'm assuming that's like the end palace thing? Or unless that's it up there, I don't know. But he said go left, and then go over to this, and then obviously that's where we had the pint, or the, a litre of beer and then go up here and get the subway two or six and that brings you back to here so yeah save this shit never know might come in handy this beer is very nice if you're from belgium uh -huh. this beer man triple i don't know what that says right but you can read it uh, very good highly recommend it's totally nice it's a bit chill um I'm gonna have this pint, or the second pint. And yeah, that'll be, that'll be a wrap for tonight. Um, we'll wake up tomorrow, we'll have breakfast at like 6 or something. Get to the train station. So the train station is like the same bit as the bus station, where I need to get the bus from here to the airport tomorrow. It's 6 it's 8 is booked for. So we'll leave at 7 get there for like 20 past 8 and yeah that's good all right i'll see you there okay so the time is 6:42. um had a shower feeling fresh um gonna head down and have some breakfast um, then pretty much just check out as soon as I finish breakfast 
get to the uh, like the train station and there's a bus station just across the road kind of thing um and then yeah get the bus get to the airport for like nine flights at 11 and yeah so it is In a bus station, or in a train station, the bus station is across the road. The bus leaves at 8. And then I'll start getting on like 4 to find out where it is. That was, that was good. Pretty much a bus came in as I walked past, so I knew like, right, that's where it is. Oh, man. Yeah, this, uh, this trip's pretty good, man. Amazing. I highly recommend you solo travel whether it's like if you want to Scotland you go to England or if you want to Scotland you go anywhere. Like literally like you have to solo travel once, at least once. It's insane man.